Margarita Sritas. So, thank you for invitation. And uh, it is a good experience for us to be in this new place. So we congratulate you to find this place and uh, uh, we think there's uh, some future in this place. <laughs> Yeah. Thank you, Father Hans Martin, for your uh, impressions you shared with us. And we got the task from you. <laughs> so we got the task, perhaps. <laughs> <laughs> and the task is we should count blessings of God. <laughs> so we think we start now. <laughs> <laughs> and then he told that it's the last sentence uh, that this gathering uh, could be a step, a step to achieve a new culture, to step to grow. So we will talk on steps. Yeah, we have a problem. Problem. Uh, I worked out this uh, speech during the night. And I sleep. <laughs> so, so we didn't share. <laughs> so we share now with you. <laughs> okay. Uh, we we uh, we want to tell you experiences. Uh, experiences we had during last meeting in Mantulaitis Parish. And uh, the time after it. Uh, in, in the harvest of, of uh, the meeting in, in Mantulaitis, uh, we heard some topics. And one important topic, topic was we need each other. And uh, we, we, we heard it in this, in this feedback that we need each other to support and to to encourage each other. Mums vienas kito reikia palaikyti ir padrasinti. And to strengthen each other. Sustiprinti. To to enjoy each other. Uh, Džiaugtis vienas kito bendrystė. And you know, Father Hans Martin told, told us on we need each other. We need community. Uh, yesterday we heard a uh, pre preparation of six calls. <coughs> and Rather said, Rasa, and it was a, a, a sentence not let's say out of the brain but out of your heart. It really she, she, she lives for together and then she's convinced only together it's possible. <laughs> Then uh, another topic was uh, the experience uh, of Father Kentenich in concentration camp, concentration camp Tachau. 
Kita tema buvo apie tėvo kentinį kopatį Dachau koncentracijos stovykloje. You were uh, impressed in this very difficult and very, very bad situation. <coughs> But the Kentinik said, yeah, what step can I do? What can I do now and what I can do now, I will do. Tėvas Kentinikas toje labai sudėtingoje patirtyje situacijoje, situacijoje jis galvojo, ką aš dabar šitoje situacijoje galiu padaryti, koks tas kitas žingsnis, ką aš galiu čia ir dabar nuveikti. And, and it was a, a motivation to, to go steps to start the six course. So we go next step. What is the next step? In this academy course we need, uh, I don't know, 20 lectures. Akademijos kurse mes turime 20 sutikimų. Who will hold these lectures? Skaitų, kas, kas, kas tas paskaitas praves. And who will organize it? Kas, kas organizuos. They did a very successful step. Padarėm labai sėkmingą žingsnį. They asked the Mantinerius to collect all this. Lectures. So continuing step by step. Uh, okay, it's it's uh, it's logical to, to do it step by step. Yra logiška nuosaklu, judėti žingsnis po žingsnio. But it's also a danger. Bet yra ir pavojus. If you are in the wood in Lithuania, it's a wood. Jeigu esi Lietuvoje miške kažkur. And you make step by step. Tiesiog žingsniuoji žingsnio. You can turn around and go there and go there. Tu gali kažkur tai vaikštinėti, sukiotis ratais. Why is the orientation? So you, you need a, a target, you need a, a destination where you want to go to. And this was for, for the Kentenich. Uh, we, we, we heard a, a conversation of for the Kentenich with a priest in Dachau. Mes žinom apie tėvo kentinio pokalbį su kunigu Dachau stovykloje. For the priest this was a very terrible situation and, and he said, yeah, uh, Father, do you think that we come out here alive? Mm, tas kunigas buvo labai, labai uh, sunkia situacija, sunkia būsena ir klausė tėvo kentinio, ar, ar, ar tu manai, kad mes galim čia iš, išgyventi. And Father Kendrick said, no, this is not the question whether we will come out alive. The question is whether, the question is whether we fulfill the will of God. So, This was the orientation of the steps of Father Kenta, always to try to find the will of God. And continue and continue. And Father Hans Martin uh, just explained now the, this mission from his view to build up a new culture. Ir tėvas Hans Martin taip pat iš savo perspektyvos pa, paaiškino tą ta, ta misiją apie naujos kultūros kūrimą. So these were three topics of the last meeting. Tai tokie, tokios buvo trys paginės temos iš praeito susitikimo. We need each other. Mums reikia vienas kito. We go step by step. Einame žingsnis po žingsno. 
And we know that we have a mission. Um, we want to, t- want to talk on other experiences we had since uh, January to now. Uh, one very, very great experience was a uh, European Family Congress in Vienna. Uh, so you know about it and you know there was also particip- participants from Lithuania. <coughs> Žinot apie šį kongresą ir kad, kad, kad taip pat buvo dalyvių iš Lietuvos. So perhaps we will hear some experiences of Ramunas later. Tai gal Ramunas šiek tiek savo patirtim galiau pasidalins. From us two, two experiences which show the practical going step by step. Iš mūsų tokias dvi patirtis, kur, kur pamatom tą žingsnis po žingsnio We went from a Hungarian family, uh, they prepared the family camps. Uh, and uh, they experienced that this was very difficult because people had no time and were exhausted and were tired and so on. Patirtis buvo sunki dėl to, kad žmonės neturėjo laiko ir buvo pervargę. And so they asked me, what is possible? What can we do? What, what can be possible steps? And they worked out a program uh, which, uh, which helped preparing for the camp. Jie parengė programą, kuri buvo pagal būtent pasiruošti tai stovyklai. So it were seven steps for seven days of the week. And for each day uh, the families got a little homework. And so this program of one week helps the families to, to be prepared. For family came. We have a PowerPoint presentation from the Hungarian family, so we can share it with you. So for us it was interesting to have steps for preparing uh, the camp. Buvo įdomu, kad uh, buvo sudėlioti žingsniai, kaip pasiruošti stovyklai. All families who will come to the camp had this homework. And also families who had no possibility to come. Aha. Visos šeimos ir kurios galėjo atvykti stovyklai, ir kurios negalėjo, turėjo tą pasiruošimo pro- programą. And, and then starts the camp. Mm. Ir po to pasiruošimo prasidėjo stovykla. So the question is, what is possible? Uh, which steps are possible? The Pagrinis klausimas, or kokie žingsniai yra realūs galimi? A second example we heard in, in this family congress. Antras pavyzdys. It reminded us to uh, this uh, conclusion of the meeting in Matulaitis. Priminė mums taip pat ir Iš iš in our meeting we said yeah, we try to care on next generation. So a lot of us uh, is engaged in preparation for marriage. Daugas iš mūsų yra įsitraukęs į pas pasiruošimo santokai mokymus. And they were very, very nice programs. Tai labai geros programos. And, and, and you do it at several places. A lot of places uh, is yes. some of you preparing uh, marriage. 
Jūs dāmas vīrās ir vietos. And now this is a project which, were, uh, uh, which was interesting for us <coughs> to care not only on, on preparation of marriage, so to make uh, good preconditions for this way of the two of this couple together. Ir mums svarbus dalyvės buvo, kad neklauba ne tik apie pasiruošimą santokai. But uh, right immediately after marriage to invite them to a, a course with ten meetings. Bet taip pat ir iš karto po santokos pakviesti dar gan vieną į vieną kursą, dešimties, dešimties susitikimų kursą. So within one year, ten meetings. Per vienerius metus dešimt susitikimų. And it's called Just Married. Kursas vadinasi tik, kas susituokia. And these young couples are really interested to come together with other couples and to share experiences. Ir šiam tik kas susituokusiam plavant krai labai aktualu susitikti su, su, su kitom jau, jaunom parom, jaunom šeimom ir dalinti savo patirtimi. And to meet with couples which can be uh, in relation of their age or their parents. Ir taip pat susitikti su, su tokiom porom, kurios, kurios, jau, gali, kurios jau yra jų, jų tėvų amžiaus. So, uh, It's very encouraging when they see, okay, so there's a couple, 20, 30, 40 years married, and mm, it seems possible. <laughs> you know, they seem to love each other, and so on. Labai padrasina tie susitikimai, kai matai, poras jau 20-30 metų susituokusias, ir panašu, kad jiems gera kartu būti. So, the speciality of this program is, Uh, it's immediately after after marriage. The pagrindinis brožas šios programas, kad jinai yra iš karto po po santokos. And it, it's limited to to 10 meetings. Ir tai yra 10 10 susitikimų programa. The meeting are, are evenings. Susitikimai vakarais. And one meeting is a weekend. Ir vienas susitikimas savaitgalį. Uh, one couple um, who was um, absolvents of academy were asked to give here as a referent uh, come to this just merit course. Viena, viena pora baigusia akademijos mokymus buvo pakviesta sudalyvauti šiose, šiose susitikimuose. And we met then on this family congress. Ta pora susitikom ir šeimų kongrese. And they told us um, their experiences with just merit. Ir jie pasidalino su mumis savo patirtimi šiame, šiame kurse. As, as reference, as speakers mm. in just married. Mm, kur, kurie būtent buvo kalbėtojai šiame kurse. Uh, the theme is, they live with their parents or grand, uh, grandparents, parents in law. Parents in law in one house. Uh, ir kai kurios dalinos, kaip kurio šeimos gyvena su savo, su savo tėvais uh, tame pačiame name. And the young couples ask, how do you see this, how do you see this, and they, had, they said, we had so many answers we didn't know before, <laughs> so we can share our experiences with the young couples. Ir tos jaunas šeimos jo užtavinėjo daug įvairių klausimų, kaip tą daryt, kaip kitą, ir mes galėjom pasidėlinti savo patirtimį.
Uh, this family congress took uh, place in, in Schoenstatt Center in Vienna. And uh, by the way, just now, uh, uh, near, the, near the chapel, a Lithuanian flag is. Yes, now for this week. <laughs> and the sisters pray for, for you, for us. And one sister is in Rome. <laughs> and we, we wrote, uh, yeah, we are now in Lithuania. <laughs> and she wrote, oh, could you, you tell it? I go into the chapel and I pray a rosary for you. In Rome there are two chapels, original chapels from Schönstatt. Also, yes. Rome there are two original Schönstatt chapels. Okay, also Schönstatt Center in Vienna. And uh, there's a yeah, mission. We we need a mission, and and we have a, a we have a photo of our mission. So we give it to you. Yes. This is a, a foundation stone out, made out of wood. <laughs> it's for, for this house, who's, uh, which is new built um, as a symbol for Holy City. Kertinės dalykas, kertinės akmuo iš medžio pagamintas ir čia tas trikampyje yra šventojo kaulį švento miesto. As we know it from Bible. Aha, švento miesto. Jeruzalėm. Yeah, and, and this is uh, made of wood. It, it, uh, this triangle is about this size. And uh, around this uh, triangle, a lot of a lot of little houses. Mm -hmm. Every family can yes, bring yes, this way. Yes, yes. 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 Yes, Netgi be paaiškimo žmonės atėjo ir iš karto pirmas dalykas, ką jie pamato, šį vaizdą. We will explain it more in detail. Šiek tiek detaliau paaiškinsime. Because 
When, when we have an Indra told us we should explain it because it's important. Why don't you explain it? So we have the task of Indra to explain it. Revelation. So it's a, a book Revelation from St. John. And just a, a short a short part of it uh, uh, we will read. Yes. Okay. Yes, yes. Ir aš pamačiau naują dangų ir naują žemę, nes pirmasis dangus ir pirmoji žemė praėjo ir jūros daugiau nebebuvo. Ir aš, Jonas, išvydau šventą į miestą, naująją Jeruzalę, nužengiančią iš dangaus nuo Dievo. Ji buvo pasipuošusi kaip nuotaka, pasipuošusi savo sužadėtiniui. Ir išgirdau galingą balsą skambantį iš dangaus, Štai Dievo buveinė tarp žmonių, jis apsigyvens pas juos ir jie bus jo tauta, ir pats Dievas, jų Dievas bus su jais. Jis nušluostis kiekvieną ašarą nuo jų akių, nebebus daugiau nei ties, nei liūdėsio, nei dėjonės, nei skausmo daugiau nebebus, nes kas buvo pirmiau, praėjo ir sėdintysis sostę tarė. Štai aš visą darau naują. Šiandien į tą vykutą svarbiu pirmą gėsmas šiandien buvo. Pick out two, uh, two, uh, two promises of God. The first promise is that He will live in our center. He is the middle, and I, I live with you. Vienas, vienas iš Dievo pažadų, kad jisai gyvens uh, tarp mūsų. And uh, the second promise is, I'm making everything new. So we talk of new culture, and God promises, yes, I will make everything new. So this is a the meaning of this symbol, Holy City, and we are convinced and, and we aim it and want to understand it, God is in the center, God lives with us. And now uh, the way we express it, uh, uh, in, in this uh, symbol. Ir kaip mes tai perteikiame šiuo, šiuo simboliu. There are a lot of houses and for all houses God is the center. Uh, tai yra aplinkui daug namų ir kiekvienam, kiekvienam nameliui uh, Dievas yra centre. So all houses are connected with God and all houses are connected with each other. Kiekvienas iš tų namelių sujungtas su, su, su Dievu ir taip pat uh, jie su, sujungti susieti tarp pusėvė. Uh, you know this picture? Žinot šį, šį piešinį. Uh, so it's on, on academy all the time we use it. Mes jį visu met naudojame akademijoje. And, and, and it's, a, it's the same understanding. Yeah, 
pagaisvas buvo sukurtas menininko. And these houses are made and painted from by families. Also our house is here painted from our grandchildren. <coughs> Tai tas centras buvo sukurtas menininko atrikampį, o kiekvienas namelis yra šeimos sukurtas, taip pat ir mūsų yra namelis, kurį nudažia nuspalino mūsų anukai. Which one is yours? Which one? Yes, we have to show this picture to our and every every family uh, can put uh, a sign on this um, house of wood when they have joy um, pay, um, Illness. illness or troubles, like to put it in the jar and write on the paper, so they made here one. Was it mm -hmm. So, right, Eva doesn't listen to me. Yes, mm -hmm. and you, <laughs> you can put it here. <laughs> or make here um, on the roof. Um, a brick. A brick or a, a window. Or it's like continuous or one time you... Well, one, uh, until you put it here. Until you put it yes. here. Yes. Huh? So you, you ca um, collect these gifts mm -hmm. for God or for the uh, mother of God and paint it here and you can fix yes. this house. The check, uh, Nuspalvint galima simboliką, atspindint, parodant savo džiaugsmą, ar lygą, sakykime, ar skausmą, tai visą galima nupaišyti, paruošti ir tada jis pritvirtinamas šia prie šios jonas. Jei nesuprato, tai jie nauja būtų sistema išradus. It's like vauto, vauto, vauto. Not so. Not so expensive. Not so expensive. So we are talking on experiences, and and we made the experience that people really like it and and understand it quickly and and feel familiar with it. Yes, it's it's ours. Nes mokamės iš patirčių ir iš tos simbolikos ir žmonės labai greitai supranta, pagauna, ką reiškia šitą simboliką. Ir mes sakome, kad yra įsivaizdžiai, kad yra įsivaizdžiai, kad yra įsivaizdžiai. Ir dar kartą grįžtų, kad labai svarbu prisiminti savo misiją, tai yra, kur veda mūsų priežingsnių. And we, we, it's important that we are sure on our doing, yes, perhaps it's not always successful, but the step goes in the right direction. Gaunas tuos žingsmus darydami ne visada esam labai sėkmingi, bet labai svarbu, kad kiekvienas tas žingsnelis mūsų vestų prie to, ta kriptimi, kurią 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 darydami. And this view of all to the same picture helps our community, it unites us. Ir šis paveikslas visų padeda mūsų bendruomenę sujungti, mes kaip ir matom tą bendrą tikslą. So, we have fulfilled the task of Indra. Taigi, iškildėm Indras užduoti įvykdėm. And 
when she, she is with you, you can ask her. So she, perhaps she can explain it better than me. Because she's really enthusiastic. <laughs> okay, uh, two more experiences. Uh, one one uh, very surprising. We leave now the field of religious uh, thinking and talking. Uh, we leave the field of talking on religion. And a short uh, experiences we had. We watched a video on YouTube of a man who is science scientist for brain uh, development of brain. Uh, and so no word on, on religion, no word on God. Only the question uh, when a man, when somebody gets, as a man or a woman, gets uh, impressions and gets information, what does it affect in the brain? Yes, and she developed uh, possibilities to, to watch, there's an information and there's have some screening of the brain and they can tell uh, in what ways this uh, information affects the brain. So we, we, we cannot explain it uh, because we are no, no scientists and, and, and we can also not explain it in German. <laughs> <laughs> but, but he said uh, uh, the brain uh, develops the whole life. So the development of the brain, the growing of the brain is not finished uh, when, 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 we are, when we are a child or uh, a child, no, it goes until the end of a life, always the development of the brain. So this is a, a very, very hopeful message. Yes, Especially for us. <laughs> We don't tell you how old we are, right? <laughs> <laughs> but we are still, still growing. <laughs> okay, so we have it proved by this, it's Gerhard Hüther, this scientist proof. We develop, we, we go on growing. <laughs> and then it tells uh, the Hüther. Hüther. And uh, then he says, uh, and now it is decisive for the development of the brain. Uh, what messages this brain gets? So. Uh, if the brain gets a message, it, it thinks, okay, do I have similar messages? And if, if it has a similar message, it makes a connection. And as more information in the same sense come to the brain, as more it is uh, established in the brain, so the brain sinks in this direction. And so two things are important. What do we see? Or what do we? What information do we uh, take to us? 
kokia informacija priimame. And how often do we, do we take this information? Ir kaip dažnai tą informaciją priimame. And now this scientist with very complicated equipment, very expensive, came to the conclusion we already heard from Father Hans Martin. Without expensive equipment, without science, he said, it So this scientist says it is uh, important to get. Uh, it's important to be in a in a group of people who have a positive attitude and think positive, and they share and have positive experiences and they share on experiences. Jis padarė išvadą, kad labai svarbu būti su tais žmonėmis, kurie mm, turi gerų patirčių ir jo, jomis dalinasi. And we, if we don't have the, the chance to be together or some occasions with people, we can share positive experiences, it will go down. Jei yeah. our development will go down. Jeigu neturėsime galimybių susitikti su kitais žmonėm ir dalintis uh, tom teigiamom patirtim, tai na, šioje srities mėginų tas vystimasis uh, mažės. So is, uh, the most important uh, forever is human relations. This is the most important fact. Pagrindinė svarbiausias dalykas tai yra žmogiškas ryšys. So I'm, I'm sorry, only a short... Uh, Uh, a short view, and but for only yeah. a short view to to psychology or to to the science to the science. Tai tai toks trumpas, ta trumpa įžanga į šią mokslininko pranešimą. So and it shows us the, the importance of uh, uh, of a group. What we in the beginning said, we need each other. And he underlined it. Yes, you need each other. And to be strong enough against all uh, problems around you are living in, you need a mission. Otherwise you cannot withstand this is all terrible information which are around you. You need a mission that you can see this uh, information which lifts you up. Jeigu neturime misijos, mum labai sunku atsispirti tai visai neigiamai ir įvairiai informacijai, kurią gauname. Tai kai turime misiją, mes galim atsirinkti ir priimti tą teigiamą informaciją, kurį mes mūsų kelių virš. So, for example, uh, our, our mission, uh, when we formulate it in this way, Uh, we care for next generation. So it, it unites us. We care for next generation. And now we share our experiences in caring our next generation. So, perhaps another time we can explain it better. Uh, but if we wanted just because it was really 
uh, really interesting for us. We come back from 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 Vilnius and we were this scientists. And, ah, yes, it is. Tai buvo tikrai labai smagu, kad grįžė iš Vilniaus išgirdo net tą mokslą, kuris kaip ir patvirtino, patvirtino tą, tą, tą mūsų patį ir supratimą. Uh, the last uh, experience we want to share with you. Paskutinis dalykas, kur, kurio norime pasidalinti. We, we wrote you already that we had meetings with sister Eileen. Mes jau dalinamės, kad turėjom sutikimus su sesė Eileen. Eileen. She is uh, 86 years old. Jie 86 metai. Came to, she is American. From America. From America. Uh, uh, a sister of Mary. Marijos sesė. From Schoenstatt. Iš Schoenstatto. And she came to Europe for about three months. At Vico i Europa trims mėnesiams. And at this time she made uh, more than 50 lectures. Ir pas tris mėnesius 50 susitikimų padarė. Pranešimų. In Germany, Switzerland, Austria and Hungary. Vokietija, Švicarija, Austrija ir Vengrija. And we listened to some... In, in German. She spoke, she spoke German. She yeah. speaks uh, almost perfect German. Yeah. And we, we listened to some lectures of her. Mes klausimės kai kurių jos paskaitų. And then we said, sister, English is your, is your, is your, is your mother tongue. Is it not easier for you to speak in English? <laughs> yeah, and then we made three, three videos in, in English just for you. And so we tried to ask her the questions out of the meeting in, in January. Tai norėjom klausėme jos klausimų, kuriuos atsinešėm iš sausio mėnesių stikimo. Prašėm patarimą, kaip, 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 kaip toliau įdėti. And we had, we, we, we a very short video for and a half minutes. Vieną video įrašėm trumpą keturių, keturių minučių. And she said, yeah, I want to start with a statement. Pasakė, noriu pradėti šiuo teiginiu. The statement is, the bird sings not because he has an answer. Tas teiginys yra, kad pauk, pauk, paukštis gėda ne dėl to, kad turi atsakymą. He sings because he has a song. Dėl kaip jisai seimoka, tai ta giesmė. So the song is perhaps more important than the answer. Ta giesmė yra svarbesnė už atsakymą. And yes, and we ask her, what steps should we go? You step by step, what steps should we go? Mes paklausime, tai kokie žingsniais turėtume žengti. Yes, I said, no, I, I could give you an answer, but uh, I will not do it. <laughs> and she said, it is important to find the answer in being together. So when you are together in a group, you can together find an answer. Kai esate kartu grupėje, galite surasti atsakymą. And she said that Father Kentini had a very positive attitude to all problems which were around. So he liked problems. Jį pasakė, kad tėvas Kentini, kas labai teigiamai žiūrėdavo į visas problemas, su kuriam susidurdavo. Because he said all problems are a challenge of God. 
atsisakydavo, kad kiekviena, kiekviena problema yra iššūkis iš dievo. And he had the confidence that he and with others could find an, an, an answer to all problems. Sonat buvo įsitikinęs, kad jis kartu, kartu su kitais gali surasti atsakymus, sprendimus kiek, kiekvieną problemą. So not to all problems at the same time, but to every problem step by step. Ne iš karto visas problemas ir spręsti, bet vieną po kitos. And she, she used a word which Father Kentenich loved very much. Jį taip pat panaudoja žodį, kurį ir Tėvas Kentinijas labai, labai mėgdavo. It is uh, in, in English about a creative tension. Uh, kur, kūrybinė įtampa, tas, tas, tas žodis, tas teiginys, kur, kur, kūrybinė įtampa. So we are because of the problems in the tension. And dėl problemų mes patiriam į įtampą. And this gives us the chance to be creative. Ir tai mums skatina būti kūrybingais. And she said, uh, in the school of Father Kentenich, she experienced him that he gives strengths. Ir... Tėvo Kentenicho mokykloje jį patyrė, kad, 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 kad būtent jisai, jisai spinduliuoja, perduoda tą stiprybę, jėgą. And he encourages to take risk. Ir padrasina prisimtis rizikos. And he helps us to find the mission. Ir, ir, ir to pačiu taip padeda mums surasti mūsų misiją. And he helps to think creatively ir padeda mąstyti kūrybiškai. And, and to find new concepts. Surasti naujas, naujus mm, sprendimus, idėjas. And to, to accept and, and like challenges. Ir taip pat pirimti ir mėgti iššūkius. So, I just explained it now in a, a few words, but when you think, oh, this is perhaps the image of a new church. Ir tie dalykai turbūt atspindi tą nau, nau, naują bažnyčią. A church who, who acts creatively. Tai yra bažnyčia, kuri veikia kūrybingai. It finds new concept. Suranda naujus, naujus atsakymus. It likes the problems which arise. <laughs> Ir taip pat mėgsta tos iššūkius problemas, kurie, kurie kyla. Because they help us to grow. Dėl kad jos padeda mums aukti. Yeah, so uh, we think it's... Uh, the question is how we, how we go the next steps to our, to our camp. Mm, tai klausimas, kokius, kokiais žingsniais judėsime link mūsų stovyklos. And so we, we ask ourselves, perhaps we could uh, also invite uh, Sister Eileen in preparing our camp. So, mm, kalbuojame gal ir sesiją Eileen galėtume įtraukti ruošiantis mūsų stovyklai. Because she, she offered it, she said, yeah, we see it as our task to meet with you and to talk with you and to find creative solutions. Jinai taip priėmė, kad tai irgi galėtų būti jos užduotis susitikti ir ieškoti kartu kūrybinių sprendimų. So, these were our experiences we wanted to share with you. Tai tokias tokiamis patirtimis norėjome su jumis pasidalinti. We will make even more experiences during the next days. And we are very thankful for the possibility uh, that you spend time for this sharing. And That's it. Uh, we thank Vitenis 
for translation. Yeah. 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 We can imagine it's not so easy to translate our bad English to a good Lithuanian. Yeah. <laughs> but he managed.